previously in the vlog. We journeyed from the Bay Area to Yucca Valley where we're staying in an Airstream Airbnb. We made it to our desert oasis after eight hours of driving, a place we'll be calling home for the next four days. As you saw in our first vlog, we arrived and settled in our Airbnb, gave you a full Airstream tour which you can check out here, and today we're heading off to Pioneer Town, a Hollywood movie set that's home to locals as well. Let's get right into the vlog. Hey guys, today is our first full day here at Joshua Tree. We are getting ready to head out to town. Yeah. Uh, Pioneer Town, actually. Yeah. <laughs> Pioneer, uh, Pioneer Town, and then uh, head out straight to Joshua Tree Visitor Park, uh, Visitor, Visitor Center, yeah. uh, to pick up uh, a map. We do have uh, all trails and Google Maps uh, downloaded offline, which you guys want to do when you're here, because uh, sometimes uh, the, the reception is very sketchy when you're hiking. So it's just better to download your Google Maps and your all trails, um, you offline. know, trails offline. Yeah. What about your first impression? Um, first impression: high desert, super dry. <laughs> um, I'm not seeing a lot of tourists, uh, people out and about in right. general. Uh, because I guess this is one of the hottest times of the year, summer, and you, it's, so it's low peak season and that's part of the reason why we came during low peak season because things are usually uh, cheaper, more affordable. But to think that it also snows in the same desert. Right? That we're standing, yeah, yeah, it's so amazing. Uh, Look at the views, all these mountains are snow capped by December, so. <laughs> um, yeah. um, so, excited about Joshua Tree? I'm super excited. I also am excited about the food here. The local food, there's like pie for the people. There's like an Indian spot, which is Sam's Indian. Sam's Indian food pizza. Something yeah, like I, I really yeah. want to go there. Yeah. Uh, and then we also have like sushi, but then you have your regular. Uh, regular American drinks, yeah. uh, like Taco Bell, Panda Express. Yes, yeah, Sonic. Sonic, yeah. So we, we you know, that's a, like a last option yeah. if we're desperate. But other than that, we're going to try to visit like all the local spots. But yeah, so it's already like uh, kind of like midday and we're gonna get ready to go because we do want to make it back uh, to watch sunset from our beautiful Airbnb here. Uh, sunset views are supposedly amazing. Well, actually, we, 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 we bit, yeah, the end of it yesterday, but we really want to do that today. Especially the sunset in Yeah, we're gonna um, have dinner here and uh, watch the sunset and you guys are gonna be right there with us. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And we have an early morning oh. tomorrow because we're gonna be getting up at 1 a.m. Oh my god. Okay, we'll be, look, be we're trip. not early morning people, but we're gonna attempt to get up yeah. that early and try to go take some beautiful astro photos. Yeah. So, fingers crossed, all that goes well. Yeah. But let's head let's over head to the town. Finally yeah. here at Pioneer Town, the signs are right in front yeah. of us. We're gonna go try to take a photo or two. Mm -hmm. It's supposed to be a very scenic four mile drive to Pioneer Town. So if you guys are looking to come, you know, you can just record that whole four miles. It's very like it's, it's windy yeah. and uh windy. and rocky. Yeah. Windy and rocky, rocky yeah. mountains and looks like a bar. It's a bar, right? Yeah. Um, you wanna go in? Yeah, go. I don't think it's a functional bar though. Really? Oh, Bobby. I thought this was. So it was a functional bar. I actually thought it was a bar, but it's really like a set. It's a set that looks like. Oh my god, this, this, this guy scared me. This guy scared me. Oh my goodness. I really thought this was a functional bar, but Wasim was like, no, it's not. It looked too quiet for a bunch. Well, I don't know. I saw some, I'm, I'm, some like, bottles of beers. I'm, I'm like, is it, could it be a, a movie set? Which, which it is. Clearly it is, yeah. yeah. Little Nas X, the Old Town, no, no. The, the, yeah, the Old Town Road. The song, whatever, the Old Town Road or something. Some, yeah. Okay, that one. If it was actually shot. Yeah, it was filmed here, so that's pretty cool. And last time I was here, they weren't too welcoming to outsiders. Eh, 
You're with me this time. Everything's gonna be all. Take my horse to the old town road. I'm gonna. I just managed to get a quarter out of a seam. To uh, feed the chickens. <laughs> He's got an address too. Does that look like someone's actual house or is that a movie set? <laughs> if any one of you knows, please let us know. Because to me, it looks like somebody lives there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But this, this is throwing me off because this kind of telling my like, Is that part of the set or is it a real truck? I really thought it was just staging like it was fake. Yeah. But it's an actual post office and we're going into this function. Do you want to go to the sheriff's? Oh, it's locked. What do you know? Sheriff's out of town, folks. You're out of luck. We've made it to the Joshua Tree uh, Visitor Center. We're going to explore a bit to learn a little bit about Joshua Tree's history and then also grab our trail guide and get out of here. It's so hot. Is our guide? A lot of trails. A lot of trails. <laughs> talks about where balloons end after it's released. So obviously it does not just disappear, it's got to land somewhere. Cute. Yeah, and you find these two. So we just got out of the visitor center yeah. and we purchased Two beautiful hats yeah. and a souvenir, <laughs> and for our travels, excited about that. I just read this so park maps when the visitor center is closed, because because that's something we could have done oh. yesterday. Oh yeah, we yeah. could have, so yeah. we didn't have so to come here. But late. it was nice to just see, you know, the history uh, of Joshua Tree yeah. and learn about uh, the faults and how oh, yeah. the rocks uh, formed. And everything yeah, and uh, organisms and uh, wildlife and things like that. Yeah, uh, and how they're affected uh, and all that stuff. So. But we, when I got out, I saw this a uh, Roadrunner uh, grab and go place. So if you guys are hungry or want to grab a quick bite to eat right after you visit, it's right across right there. Eleven a.m. to three p.m. Four thirty to nine. Yeah, we're getting the delicious Punjabi pizza. It uh, has the korma sauce and we got the medium. We have the paneer in there, garlic, onion, cilantro, and ginger. It smells really good. Good morning guys. It is 1.30 in the morning. 